So for me, it's a necessity for my art to have meaning and make sense. I love for it to tell a story and be captivating in a way. And I think lately creating has been teaching me that it's not always going to go as planned. Um, my gears start going and I think of all these big ideas, but a lot of times I have to scale it down because I don't have the biggest team right now. I don't have all this gear. I don't have all this money. So, uh, but I think it's, it's fun. It, it's been challenging, but I think it's helping me to become a better artist, a better uh, creative visionary, all that. And um, yeah. So creating Sunflower was actually a rush process. And I had already came up with the treatment, found the location, all that jazz, uh, just to get to the place the day of a shoot and find someone there already using it. And that was pretty annoying, but just like I said earlier, you know, that's part of the process I'm learning. Uh, things don't always go as planned, but honestly, I'm happy that it went the way it did because I'm really happy with how the video turned out. Um, and so I had to think on my toes, redo everything. Uh, I think in like a night, I had to come up with a new shot list and all that. Uh, thankfully, I remembered this rose garden that my mom took Skip and I to, uh, and it was so beautiful. Um, but it was a challenge, and I'm sure you guys can maybe understand why, because the song is titled Sunflower and we're in a garden full of roses. So honestly, I'm sitting here wondering how the hell am I gonna figure this out and put it together so it makes sense, because you know, I have to have it make sense. Um, and I'm meditating on the meaning of the song and the lyrics, the symbolism of sunflowers and roses. And I come up with this. Roses are commonly used when it comes to love. You receive them on Valentine's Day, all that jazz. And I figured, okay, he's trying to find a home. He's trying to find what he's looking for, which is something that's super rare. And uh, I made the sunflower be the anomaly. And we just went to like an arts and crafts store and got a fake sunflower. I found this loophole in the garden and just stabbed it in the ground. And so that's how that went. Uh, I want to talk about the song a little bit more too. So in the song, Skip is talking about whether or not he can find a home in someone. It's like, okay, I think I love you. You say you love me, but why do you keep treating me this way? And it's that dreadful, honestly terrifying feeling of trying to find comfort and peace uh, in the pursuit of love. Because I think we all crave love in one way or another. But I think sometimes during that pursuit, we can become desperate and we settle. And sometimes we don't even know what love is. And when that's the case, we'll take the first thing that comes our way. So, um, yeah, I think uh, everybody can relate to that. Um, and everybody kind of wants something specific when it comes to, especially really romantic love. Everybody wants to find the one. I'll just say that. How about that? 